Hello everybody, Average Gamer here. Welcome to The Crew 2, the quest to get a challenger. So if you guys don't know, uh, the challenger is like my favorite car in the world. Um, I've got one, uh, just a standard challenger. No Hellcat, uh, no Demon, just a, just your standard run of the mill challenger. Um, she's only a month old though, so pretty good. Uh, well actually no, by now it's actually January, February, March, April. We're in August. Eight months old. So what we're going to be doing here is playing the Crew 2 to get a Challenger. Um, and then we're going to, I believe the game has a Hellcat. It doesn't have a Demon. But from what I've been told, we can modify it to be a Demon. Um, there'll be a 100 horsepower difference, but what's the worst that could happen, right? So I have to just pick an automatic person already. Alright, well I'm going to pick. Uh, you're kind of like me, but I don't like the American hat. I like the helmet though. <laughs> no. We're gonna go for generic ma white male number one. What? Hold A. Oh my god, what's with the games now and having to hold buttons? It's all started with you, No Man's Guy. Got my coffee with me? Oh. Okay, guys, come on, get a move on. We're going on soon. Ah, Hiroyuki Carter. Hey, call me Hiro. Pleasure to meet you. I was beginning to think you and your driver weren't going to make it. I'm from Live, the camera company sponsoring this race, and I'll be heading up this event. Wow. Look, Lip sync is horrible. Again. I'm really stoked about this. Thanks for giving us the shot. Don't mention it. We're always on the lookout for new talent, and you and your friend fit the bill. And I don't have to tell you this, but if you do right by yourselves in this race, you'll see a lot of doors opening up for you. Gotcha. We won't disappoint you. Disappoint me? That's not what this is about. It's your chance to impress people who matter. The events my company organizes are a feeder for every racing family out there. You do want to race, yeah? No, not really. I'm oh, good. yeah. This is such a big deal for us. We've tried broadcasting our races, but no dice. I guess nobody wants to see nobody's. Trust me. Just show the world what you've got in this one. And you'll get followers like that. So is this supposed to be in New Run York? Race, and you'll find your options and your followers increasing. We'll give it our best. Hero, my friend. I don't want your best. I want legendary. Are we driving the Nissan or the Porsche? Anyway, I've got to go. Something about putting on a race. I'm not a big fan of Camaros. Okay, thanks. I think that's a Camaro. You're good to go, buddy. Break a leg. Help break anything you have. Oh, we're driving a Porsche. Nice. I know you can, and we'll be in the big leagues in no time. So I'm assuming we're just starting. Oh, wait, what? Welcome to oh, the okay. city that never sleeps. In this event, you'll see New York taken over by racers in a way you never could have imagined. It's not just a city. It's a playground for the best pilots and drivers of today and tomorrow. So, do I just go? Yeah, I'm just gonna go. the first episode of this year's live extreme series in this new season talented newcomers have a shot at taking on established stars and a chance to impress all the racing teams <laughs> out. and believe me they're watching and just as oh. important they need to generate excitement that's how fans flock to them and that's what it's all about right become a racer steal the show and see Wait, your I just numbers make soar. the wrong turn oh it's been a wrong turn
Speaking of soaring, get a load of that jump. There you have it, folks. The numbers are going through the roof. Not bad. It's a good little racing game. We'll give it that. Pull back. Yeah. Alright, so this is just a generic race. Like, we can't win and we can't lose either. Type thing. You'll gain followers by winning, of course, but that's not the only way. Do a spectacular stun like this, and the oh. fans will come a running. Check it out. I'm not a big fan of this nitrous thing. I'm assuming we're going to be switching over to planes very soon. We're two thirds of the way through, and I believe we're watching a new star exploding onto the circuit. Screw you, Fergus. for the grand finale. Okay, so our aircraft controls inverted though is the question. This yep. is how it is They're these proper. days. Just being a good pilot isn't enough anymore. You've got to shine on and off the course. Staying sharp on the social media side. It's simple math. The more followers you have, the more followers you'll get. Sign on with your first racing team, and the second will start looking at you. Pile up supporters, and the contracts will be knocking on your door. To put it another way, a driver who attracts enough followers will open up new styles of racing. We're getting this we call them disciplines. Y'all call them awesome. And isn't awesome what we're all after? Knife. From the heart of New York City, this was the Live Extreme Series, Episode 1. Thank you for watching, and remember to follow us on all social media. That was kind of cool. I liked it. Game feels good. We'll give it that. Definitely feels good. What, what's wow, we got an achievement. Nice. Look at that. We're called anonymous. Cool. It is official, my friend. We have made the big time. We're still going to have to prove ourselves, but that's more than fine. You know, we've got the right stuff. There's so much to try. Boats, planes, all kinds of cars. It's like the world's biggest buffet menu. Is that the challenger there? I think that was the challenger there. We're talking street racers, off-road, pro racing, freestyle. We could take a test run with any of them. Or if you ask me, do them all. Pick which one you want to try first and let's go. My friend, welcome to the Motor Nation. So we can do anything, motorcycles, off-road, anything, but we want to get the muscle car. Now, we've got four ways we can get this puppy rolling. It's your pick. How do you want to start? Street racing, off-road, freestyle. What happened to Ontario? <laughs> Oh, I can zoom in. Nice. 
So I like how the US is to almost kind of scale. Because apparently you can start up here in Seattle and drive all the way to Miami if you want. And up. And I love how all the cities are kind of like... I'm assuming this might be Dallas? Uh, New Orleans? I'm not too sure what city this would be. My American geography is not the best. I personally would be in this little area here. So I like how Canada is kind of cut off with... So this would be... Oh wait, no. This would be Lake Erie. And this would be Lake Ontario. Slash the St. Lawrence, I guess. Which means if... Wow, okay, yeah. They really kind of... Let's, uh, let's do street racing. That's what we just did, so... Free vehicle. Uh, and we get a livery editor. Cool. So I just hit select again. Perfect. Because we want a muscle car. Screw these performance and sports cars and stuff. Oh, is that challenger the right? It is! Oh, it's a Hellcat. Look what there we, we go. Here. The name's Wait. I'm sort of like the unofficial oh, welcoming no, 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 okay. committee for the street racing family. We tune our rides, show them off, and race them. If that sounds like something you want in on, you gotta show me something. I'll loan you a car, but you gotta do the driving. If you win, you're one of us. Pick the Just car? The car's a loaner. Don't scratch. Oh no, I'm in a Porsche. Oh, yeah. Oh, for a second I thought I was in the Challenger. If they gave me a Challenger right off the bat, I'd be so happy. But I'm in a Porsche. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Wait. Oh, I'm against two Challengers. That's a Camaro beside me. I don't know. I'm gonna assume the races start off easy. All right, so you can use your boost to get into position as well. So if you make a bad turn, like I'm about to here, you can use it to get back into position. We didn't win. Close. All right, you did it. Now come with me. Got something I'm for you. I still think you're gonna going. Lie. I was gonna say, I don't know what happens after this. Like, do I keep going or what? Welcome to the street racing family. Oh, well, it's because I want the bloody challenger. Oh. That was a fine oh. race, oh. which means you punched the ticket oh. to the spot, the place where the street racing community hangs. I'm part of the crew here that's looking to take what we do legit. Feel the same that's way? Our T Hellcat. Maybe we can help each other out. This guy, on the other hand, wants to keep it on the streets. His name's Edgar Marquez, but you best call him Tito. He's the champion racer around here, the king of the quarter mile. You want to take a shot at him, it's going to take everything you've got. 
and maybe a few things I can teach you. You got talent, and I can give you skills. The Mazda. You see those cars? One of them's mm -hmm. yours. Reward for winning their trial. It'll be a little tougher to earn the rest, though. You gotta buy those. Win enough races, get enough cred, and you'll get to play with all sorts of toys. Drifting, Wait, drag that, racing. Oh. Prison, I thought a challenger out. was mixed in. You gotta run, and you gotta. Oh, uh, well, we're gonna take. Now, I think that's a Viper because it's Dodge. Get behind the wheel, and let's see what you got. I'm not a big fan of drifting. I like drag racing though. What are you? Well, I can test drive it. <laughs> Alright, so we'll test drive each one of these first. Because the car I want was right over there a second ago. Can I run? No. Okay, well, we'll take. No. You know what? I want a good flat spot where I can just gun this thing. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely taking the Viper. Oh, wait, you can pick... Wait, what? So this is the SRT8. It's 147. Uh, can I go filter? Let's go by brand. Dodge. Wait, there's only one challenger in this game. No. Oh. So we got a Mustang Fastback, a Coupe, a Silverado pickup. Oh, yeah. Wait a second. Oh, here we go. Now there's a lot more stuff here. Dowage. Here we go. So this is the SRT8, and it's the right color, too. Yeah, Charger. The SRT Hellcat. There we go. That's it. So we got a Hellcat and an SRT8. This is what we got. 392 Hemi in it. You're 215 versus 350. Okay, so we got a bit of a ways to go, because this is the one we're going to want to get.
if I close, are you going to be a Hellcat? <laughs> no. So, this is the car I actually have in real life. Wait, does it have, like, racing slits on it or something? The fastest I've gotten mine up to is 187. It's gonna rainy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rain and challengers don't mix. Okay, well. We're definitely going to have to get two challengers now. So the plan is to get more than one challenger. So we have a free car that we can pick. So we're going to go all the way to the back to the beginning. So we've got either a Mustang. Audi. Top speed's 250. 250, 420, 400. Okay, well, we're going to go with, well, obviously, whatever has the most horsepower slash speed. Actually, it even says handling's more easier. Oh, yeah, we're gonna go with the Mustang. Uh, yeah. I don't get to change anything else. All right, still, that's good. So we need to save up like three hundred thousand dollars. That's a lot of money. Cool. You know how we were talking about tricking out our rides? Now we've got the tools to do it at the house. Just no flame decals, okay? So what was this? The Strip South Street Race versus the Sleeper Street Race. Or home. What's home? Oh. Hero in the house. Oh, I love this place. We can kick back, you can change your clothes, or swap the look of the vehicles bumper to bumper. Or you could do whatever else it is you do when you're not driving. I'm not really sure. There must be other stuff too. This place is huge. I mean, just look around. Sleeping on pallets. Can you change that to a Canadian flag, please? Microwave a burrito? No, so I can't really do much. I'm assuming this is my changing area. Challenger. Well, I guess we'll just, uh,. So do I just go into the map or whatever? Well, here we go. Here, you'll find the different things you can do with each family. It's everything tagged on the live map, just organized differently. You can find events, of course, sorted by disciplines. Skills are also here, so you can try to beat records set by your friends and rivals. And last but not least, there's the photo album. Papa John's. Wow. wow. So we need to get a lot of money this here. This is hello ground you're driving on. Right here is where Teal, the champion, made his bones. If you win here, it is damn certain you're going to attract his attention. Look, I had to drive up to it. That's pretty cool.
Can't do that. First, I knew you could do it. <laughs> oh, screw you, hippie. We went from first to seventh. <laughs> so, sort of mental note, uh, shortcuts, not a big thing in this game. Finished in fifth. We're going to retry that because uh, I screwed up. <laughs> talking because there's lots of concentration going on. like on my crib this entire time. Gotta get that. It's gonna use that NOS just a little bit extra every here and there. I, mean, I don't know if it actually works or not, but. Fucking 
viper like right on my butt. Well, right, well, that's good enough. Hey, look! We got loot for that! You should grab it. I'm sure it's gonna come in handy. The loot consists of parts you can use to upgrade your rides. Uh, so keep bringing okay. it in. Ah, sweet! Up till now, we've only gotten green loot. But other colored loot has even cooler stuff. Hear that beeping? That's your radar going off. Which means there's a live reward nearby that you can track down and collect. The closer you are, the faster the beeps. See if you can find it. Radar only works when you're on the move. So get rolling if you want to find the live reward. So now the radar is stopped. You can open the map and see if there are any activities available anywhere. Not that just pound around isn't fun. There's something over here? Is that it right there? Oh. You found it. Good eye. Live rewards pop up all over the place. You can always use your radar to find them. Okay. So, oh, okay, cool. Well, I'm assuming that's the street race I just did. Ground jump, roller jump. Are we in what, Las Vegas? Yeah, okay, we're somewhere in Las Vegas. Off road. The sleeper street race. Let's do that. I can switch vehicles? Well, I only have one vehicle. <laughs> Look at the hot shot rookie. Thinks they can just roll in and walk away with it. You race for pinks? 
We're gonna be walking, all right. Now, this is what it's all about for some folks. Lies, people, party. Easy to see why going legit doesn't appeal. Gonna take some time to get more people to see it my way. Time I got. Just look at those cars. There's some mighty fine rides lining up out there. Here we go. Three, two, one. Wow, your sleeper car just woke up in a big way. Is really moving the wrong way. So my question is, if I hit other cars, can I knock them out? Like, can I pit maneuver guys? Let's find out. Thanks, sir. The trail is a loadout like that street legal? None of this is street legal, hero. That's kind of the point. Hard to make people want to go legit when it means giving up something like this. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can actually knock other cars out. I can run them over. Doing things gets you followers. The more followers you have, the more you'll be invited to do cool new things where you can earn even more followers. And bucks. Big bucks. Which we can use to buy all the cool stuff we want. Not bad. Street racing's got history. It didn't start with us. Some say it began in the 20s with bootleggers. They needed to outrun revenuers, so they tricked out their cars in order to make a clean getaway. Those souped-up roasters and stock cars, you can draw a line from them to the street machines you see today. 
and from those drivers to us. Go! Try that again. So... I do want to turn the music down. assume it's something else. So I'm on the freeway here. Oh! Not bad. So... Let's do this one! Classic cars, who doesn't love them? More importantly, who doesn't want to race them? That's what you're going to get to do on a closed course wrangler just for us. It's a dream race, so go enjoy and win. game I mean I'm assuming the point is to get better and better and better cars I'm assuming you're in last oh, place sure. somebody's cheating
The moment I get on the highway area, I'll pass over there. But it's that freaking ramp section that screws me up every time. Plus 13,000. I right, so... Now what? So do I have to do all of the major races first? I'm gonna assume the answer to that question is yes. So, in the next video, we're going to do the, I guess, the in the, the initial um, airplane races. And then in the next bunch of episodes, the off-road trail races. And then the pro racing trail races. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you in the next episode. Bye-bye.